For practice itself, check 2.36, loop table constant. We are given this table right here, and we need to write an expression that uses a line value, size value, and gives us number of characters. To do this first, we have um, we can look at the first two numbers, 17 and 13. We can use the slope method, where we have y2 minus y1, or in this case, 17 minus 13 over 2 minus 1. This is going to give us the value 4. So we're going to have 4 times line in here. Now, if we look at this, we need to incorporate size. And we know this because if we use 1, the line value, times 4 right here, we're not going to get 13. We're going to get 4. What we need to do is f get this to be 13. So what we can do is we can take what we have and subtract it from what we need. We have 4 right here. We need 13 here. So what we need is 9 more. So we're going to have plus 9 in some way. But we need to use a size value. So we could say size, which in this case is 3. And since we need 9, we can multiply it by 3. We can check out this is the right answer by using it for 17. So for the next line value, it's 2. We have 4 times 2, which is 8, plus 3 times 3, which is 9. So we are going to get 17. So this should be correct. Now we move on to the next one. Well, if we look at the slope for these again, we're going to see that we get negative 1. We're going to multiply this by line. And then we still need to find the size part. So we have 1 times this negative 1. So we are going to have negative 1. But we need 10. So basically, we need 11. What we can do here is add 11. If we add 11, we will get to our 10. But we don't have, we can't just add 11. We need to use a size value. So instead of adding 11, we can say, size times, and the closest thing to 11 with 4 is 2, that'll give us 8. Then we can just add 3 like this, and that'll give us 11. We can check if this is the same for this number right here. Our line value is going to be 3, so we have negative 1 times 3, so we'll have negative 3 for this part, and then we'll have size times 2, which will be 4 times 2, which is 8, plus 3, which gives us 11. 11 minus 3 gives us 8. If we submit this, we have not passed the test. And that is because we need spacing. Between our values and it might also be correct if size, they might want it to be formatted where size is behind the value. So we'll do, we'll just move some stuff around like this and then resubmit it. And then it is correct. So both ways were correct. They just wanted a certain type of way written in our answer.